Hey guys, welcome back. More Star Wars The Force Unleashed. It's Clouded Truth here. And it's been a little while since I posted this video. Some of you guys out there have been waiting for it. So here you go. Alright, so now we're going to find out what we are hunting. Alright, so hunting, hunting this old dude. Of course. I bring Darth Vader's enemies don't, to don't ask too many questions, lady. Now, sir, do you? Master Coda was okay. a military genius, but felt that clone soldiers were unfit for battle. Aren't you guys happy with subtitles? So am I. <laughs> no derp! Man, a droid could figure that out. But, yeah, I'm, I'm really sorry. I completely, completely forgot this game had subtitles. Because I never had ever played with them on or even looked for them. Because I just never really had to. So, I don't know. I, I'm, I'm really sorry, guys. I didn't put this up there beforehand. And uh, we have it now. So, it, I can talk over top of the... Uh, Everyone during these little like guess cool cutscene kind of things, and you all can uh, still know what's going on uh, in the story. All squads to fan out and funnel any opposition towards us. Explosive charges. Nice old dude. Two, five, and twelve, just like we planned. General Coda. That's a huge gap between five and twelve. I guess well, it's true. You take out the bottom, then the top will fall. Tis true. Tis true. Lower the containment. Hey, that's our ship. Twelve, and tell the men to get in a position. Yes, General. Why would you want to tell them in the new position? Alright, so it looks like we're finally going to have our very first mission as the uh, uh, apprentice to Darth Vader. Ooh, that's such an awesome name for a ship, too. Rogue Shadow. What a nice name. But, yep. First mission is as a Star Killer, which is about the most beastly name ever. And come here, you droid. I'm going to destroy you. Come here. Nope, nope, nope. Nope. There we go. I love these George's like split in half. They're like a little gong. Wow. There we go. Die, R2 or R6 or whatever your name is. R R4. As they'll be able to say, ooh, careful awful. But uh, R4 dies. Oh well. <laughs> Blast through doors by hitting the circle button. Alright, there we go. Okay. Here we are in the hangar and we're killing some stormtroopers. And uh, there is a uh, a little mission you can do, a side quest, I guess you'd say, in here. That's uh, part of it right there. Destroy TIE Fighters, and I missed right there with one of them. But I got one TIE Fighter dead, so we destroy a four more. Here's the oh, unlimited energy. This is a Sith Holocron, and you guys who have played this game know what these are. And if you haven't, well, basically Sith Holocrons are... Uh, they give you uh, energy is what they well not er energy they give you basically like an upgrade for a limited time gosh such a beast um like this one's unlimited energy meaning you can use your force powers non-stop and uh it won't drain it of the of any force energy at all there's also ones for damage increase there's ones for uh invincibility and i think a health training aura is another one which is pretty good they're very helpful in boss fights you will get um sometimes a little bit later in the game but right now we got to get this holocron over here if i can jump up oh, come on sunshine let's go there we go but yeah that's what the holocrons are very very useful sometimes for me not as useful as they could be in other situations but get up there but uh you know i'll still take them i, I still will but this one i just grabbed a second ago is a wow well, random tie fire blew up is a Jedi holocron, and there's another one. There it is, right up here. So if you didn't know where this is, there's one right here. These contain different things. One of them right like that, yellow lightsaber crystal, meaning I could change my lightsaber color to yellow right now if I wanted to. And a lot of times during the actual game, I do, but for this mission, I will play as red because I really haven't done that that much. I think on the very first time I played through this game, actually, I found that because I wondered why that ship was sitting there. I jumped on it, and sure enough, got up there and... Uh, found that uh, lightsaber crystal so i'm not a huge fan of red but if you guys are uh, like oh you're a sith oh you're a sith you have to play as red then well i mean i might i don't know i really like uh, other colors once i find some blue and green i will probably use those a lot my favorite color as you'll know is uh, green and uh, gold i like those a lot i also like blue a pretty good amount ow that grenade hurt 
But, uh, you know, I'll probably play with red through just this mission only. And the next one, I like to switch to a yellow at least. Well, because it's kind of a yellow-brownish world, and I don't know. I think my lightsaber blends in kind of well with it, but that's just me. Oh! What? Why didn't that count as a TIE Fighter destroy? Ah, whatever. Whatever. Oh, I completely did not even mean to grab that block. And, wow, okay, okay. There we go. My goodness. A terrible, terrible aim. So, all right, let's see if we can kill these TIE Fighters. That's not the TIE Fighter. Come on, hit the TIE Fighter. Wow. Hit the TIE Fighter. There you go. See, that wasn't that hard. Come on. Whoa, that just fell down. All right, let's try it again. Let's try it again. Come on, got to grab a lot. There we go. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Hit it. Wow, you, you are terrible. Come on. Why didn't it blow up? Should have blew up. All right. Come on. Wow, what is that thing? Invincible? My goodness, I'm like just obliterating it with these little block things. All right, let's try this one. And you didn't even throw it. Can't you... I think you can grab them, the TIE Fighters. I think you can use your force and pull them down. Can you? Well, okay, we'll try this one more time, see if this works. Or not, we'll just drop it. I guess that works too. Gosh. You know what, I'm about to just just forget and give up. What? What are these things made of? Oh my goodness. All right. Come on, get up. Get on top. Forget it, forget it. All right. Try the explosive. Wow, even that didn't work, and that blows up on contact. Apprentice, you are so bad. Wait, there we go. Ow. All right. No, I don't want that. Come here. Wait for my force to recharge. Come on. No. I don't want you. I don't want you. Get away. Come on, recharge. There we go. There we go. That's it. Good. Oh my goodness, that user takes me about 30 seconds. It really does. I don't know why it took me so long. Hopefully, I don't... Well, it might even cut our time short from today. How long I wanted to get into this. Hopefully not, but it might, so... Alright, we earned a, a forced talent sphere, I believe it was. So, I will not do any kind of upgrading or things like that until uh, right before the boss. Because you really don't need it the level generally I do but because of time it'll be much easier if I just wait and do it then and uh, plus you all can see it because at the end of a level you kind of get everything you need to and uh, I don't have to stop every time I earn something new throughout the level I can just do it all at once at the end and there should be a holocron in here yeah I can do it uh, at once all at once during the end and you guys can see uh, what I upgrade so as you can see there when I get a Jedi holocron the uh, oh come here come here come here Booge! When you get a Jedi holocron, or I guess you, uh, when you walk over and capture it, base, I don't even know what the word is, or obtain, I guess. Um, ooh, level up. Force Towns Fair. Da, 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 da. No, I don't want to do this right now. Let's do it for the time. But, uh, it will restore your, uh, it also will restore your force powers, which is really, really nice. Especially if you're kind of fighting through a bunch of guys and, uh, using your, uh, your force push, and, uh, eventually, eventually, Force Lightning. Oh, yes. We'll get that. Don't you worry. We'll get Force Lightning. So, you can uh, you can basically keep using that because it restores it. And Jeez, those things got destroyed. Goodbye, sir. Which is really nice because, you know, it's a pain sometimes having to wait for it to recharge. And right at the beginning of the game, it's it takes the longest of any time for your Force Powers to recharge. And you use the, the, uh, the most of it for, like, the, I guess, the fewest power of attacks. Like, to grab stuff, you use a pretty good amount of force to uh, force push something. You use a, a, a large amount as well. And once we upgrade our, like, force kind of special or force talents, we can uh, limit that, which is uh, very helpful because, I mean, why would you want to be using a ton of force power to do, like, little simple moves? So, oh, man, that guy just got destroyed. Oh, Holocron. I know there's a Holocron in here, so... Come here. Die. 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 Man, stormtroopers are so easy to kill. Um, by the way, my uh, class has started today for school. Ooh, talent sphere. So, um, it is going to be kind of difficult this year. Ooh, snap. 
So I uh, I don't exactly know as far as of uh, why are these guys attacking me. That's weird. But I don't know as far as video uh, posting time. I still want to continue doing what I have been doing. I enjoy getting one a day out there for you all, just so you know you have something to look forward to. There's a few times uh, throughout the time I've been doing this on YouTube that I haven't been able to do that. But uh, oh jeez. But mostly I try to do one a day. That way you know. It's like you all can know when to expect it, but uh, if I don't post one, just it's usually because of school or some other uh, some other family issues come up. I know. Hopefully, you all can understand that. You know, sometimes you uh, have to make sacrifices, which uh, you know you don't really you don't want to, obviously, but it's something that you got to do. Should be a Hulk right here, yeah. So hopefully, this won't put me uh, off schedule at all. I'm taking well for me, kind of more difficult classes. I'm taking a Spanish class, so that uh, that's gonna be interesting. I. Uh, I have a teacher who thinks she's really good. <laughs> That's what she said today. So she told she told us in class that she was a good teacher, which I hate teachers that are like that. And uh, I've got two teachers so far that have trouble talking, like not really like impediment speech, but uh, they can't really form sentences very well, which is a little bit weird. But whatever, you know what? You still gotta learn the material. So oh, get stabbed, buddy. Get out of here. But hopefully it won't be a really, really, really long semester with uh, a lot of hardships. Goodbye, sir. <laughs> but you know what? I'm not here to talk about negative stuff in school and uh, how bad it's going to be. Because you know what? That's safe for school. This is this is a Star Wars game that's absolutely amazing. And uh, it's a lot of fun. So guys, be sure to pick this up if you have never tried this game before. It's definitely worth getting. Because Stormtroopers will die in one swipe with your lightsaber. And you can watch them. Oh, <laughs> just watch them just go uh, down into the abyss below and die, which is fun. Well, I think it's kind of funny, so. Man, these rebels are, like, everywhere. Did he, like, bring an entire army here? Wait, you're dead. Why am I hitting you? Come here. Boom! Get out of here. Doosh. That's what I thought. There's one more. Yeah, there is. Hello there. Goodbye. <laughs> Ah, it's one of these guys. I hate these guys. They're like General Grievous' bodyguards. They have these little, like, electric, uh, like, magnetic thingamajigs. You know what they're called. Like, little swords that, uh, that can block your lightsaber. So it's really frustrating, and they're, like, ridiculously aggressive. And, oh, come here. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Oh, snap! <laughs> oh, my goodness. That guy just went plummeting to the abyss below. Oh, jeez. But, yeah, those guys are really annoying to fight because they always seem to get a couple of hits in on you for some apparent reason. I've got no idea how or why, but uh, you know what? we got to deal with them in the best way that we can. These rebels are so dumb. So stupid. I don't really want to fight those guys. Well, I don't know. Nah, I think there may be one or two left. Anyway, guys, that's all we have time for today. I will see you all next time. Bye.